strategies in Trade Lab using the pre-made templates. The first thing we're gonna do is click the community strategies on the left side, and then we're gonna scroll down until we find the uh, Trade Pro template. It's towards the bottom. So here it is on the left. We have a combo template, and this will actually trade long and shorts in one uh, strategy. So uh, you'll notice that it says long right now, but depending on what alerts it gets, it'll actually switch between long and short. So what we wanna do is click copy and hit yes. Okay, and this will take us to the My Strategies page where we can see my Trade Pro template is right here. Uh, let's go ahead and set it up. Click the edit button, and this will load up the strategy setup screen. Uh, it says that we need to follow three steps to set up our alerts, so let's go ahead and do that now. We'll click do it now, and it'll first ask us to set up our exchange, so go ahead and select whatever exchange you want to use. If you haven't set one up, you can do so in the settings screen, and then you can select a symbol. So we'll do uh, BAT USD today, and then we'll click continue. All right, so now it's gonna show you uh, three of the steps that we need to follow to set up our alerts in TradingView. So we'll click on the first one. And if we follow the instructions, it says to open the indicator strategy settings pop-up in TradingView, and then scroll down to the alert section uh, and find the long take profit and long stop loss checkboxes. We can see that we have a long entry and a long take profit and a long stop loss. We're gonna go ahead and uncheck the bottom two. And we're also gonna do the same thing for the short as well. We're gonna uncheck the take profit and the stop loss there. So the only ones we wanna focus on are the entry boxes. And what we're gonna do is we're going to click on this message right here and this is gonna copy this. And we're going to have that paste right into that box for long entry, okay? Then we're gonna click back. We'll go to short entry. We're gonna click on this again, and we're gonna paste that right into the short entry right there. Once that's done, you can close that pop-up and we'll hit back. We'll also need to set up a trading view alert. So if we click on the last step and read the instructions, it says open the create pop-up window in trading view and follow the instructions below. Okay, so we'll open up the create pop-up window. And in here, we're gonna select our uh, trade pro strategy. And in the conditions, it says select alert function calls only. All right, that actually gets rid of our uh, message, so we don't have to worry about that. The only thing we do have to worry about is clicking on our webhook, and we have to paste that into our webhook box right, right over there, okay? Once that's done, you'll hit Create, and you should see it pop up on the right side, and there you go. So now you have your alert set up. We'll click Back, and we'll hit All Done on Trade Lab. Okay, last things we need to set up are how much you wanna trade and how you wanna trade. So uh, how much do we wanna trade? We can say $50. So if I select amount type USD 50, type in 50 here, I will trade $50 every time, okay? If I select percentage and I say 5%, 5% of my balance right now is $42 and at the reference price of 57 cents of bat, that gives me 74 cents or 74 coins of bat. If I do two times leverage, that gives me double the bat, and you'll notice that my margin size stays the same, as you would expect. Um, we are gonna do a limit order for Trade Pro. Uh, I've set the time and force to good till close, and I've also set a default timeout of one minute for everybody. If you'd like to change that, this is hours, minutes, and seconds. You can type in whatever you want. Um, other than that, that is all you really need to do to set this up. You fill in your um, amount, set up your symbol, and you set up your alerts. You can go ahead and hit save. 
or actually we'll hit save and exit. And now we can see that our trade pro template is set up trading back and it's looking for entry. That means it's ready to go. So the one thing that we might want to do is test this to see if it works. So why don't we do that? Uh, what we can do is go back into the edit screen. We can hop over to the alerts tab one more time. And this little, uh, you know, paper airplane looking thing, uh, this button is the send alert button. So if we click on long entry, we can send a test alert and it'll ask us to type in our take and our limit price. You'll want to set your limit and take prices to something that's relevant to the current prices of the market. And so when we're sending a test alert, we can also place real orders. If you check this box down here, whenever this test alert fires, it'll place a real order. And then we can hit this button to send alert and we can see that the alert sent. Um, we can see that it ran my uh, trade pro template and it ran my uh, long and it succeeded. And we can see that it ran my actions. We can also see that it just successfully placed an order. Um, and so everything went well. Uh, so if I go back to my strategies and I look here, I can see that it has an open long and it's looking for exit. With a current margin of 42, that was 5% of my balance. So we're good to go. All right, if anybody has any questions, let me know. You can always join our Discord. Um, you can also go to the bottom right uh, to this help button and you can ask any questions you got here or create a support ticket. Thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe for more updates and have a good day.